is Noah Vesely. Uh, I am a software engineer at Freedom of the Press Foundation. I work on Secure Drop. It's a uh, whistleblower submission platform. Um, we're currently deployed in 20 something news organizations, mostly in the US, but we have a number of uh, organizations abroad who are also adopting. This system is designed to be used by news organizations who wish to provide a platform where sources who uh, want to who want to protect their identity because they're uh, potentially exposing um, corrupt acts by maybe powerful people or not as powerful people but still want to uh, ensure that this source of information does not get tracked back to them are able to uh, pass along this information and hopefully uh, serve some public interest in the process. To secure drop, uh, an adversary could be uh, anyone from like a local police department or a government agency to a uh, corporation that someone works for um, to uh, really uh, any sort of actor. Uh, and we realize that there are some very powerful state level adversaries who have very good uh, hacking capabilities. GPG in Secure Drop allows us to um, keep information on uh, the web server um, in an encrypted form so that the web server, uh, only for very brief periods of time, has any access to any like plain text material. We've decided on GPG uh, instead of other alternatives, um, which we've had to weigh carefully, um, uh, in large part due to the fact that GPG is the most well-known and most used um, tool for asymmetric encryption. GPG is a free software implementation that is widely considered to be a very good implementation. Um, and the uniqueness over this, besides using some library that might have some fancier crypto, maybe like Libsodium or something, um, is that uh, there are no end user tools for those sorts of libraries. Whereas for GPG, um, we can publish the public key of this air, offline air gap, which in which uh, submissions eventually get decrypted and uh, sources themselves are able to download that and use it to uh, provide the best uh, uh, in encryption, like what would, we would call end-to-end -end encryption possible uh, for them to make sure that at no point, even if our web server is compromised um, by some adversary, can that adversary see the submissions. I definitely think that sources who uh, know how to use uh, GNU PG already uh, would definitely uh, value that they can, on their own end, locally encrypt things, and that, that is secured all the way to an air gap in our model. Uh, and I think that might make the difference between some sources who are aware of what these technologies do, feeling comfortable uh, submitting these documents.